Now, you're one of, I think, maybe the only guitar player that I know who's really ambidextrous to the core. And so you may have a different answer, which I'd love to get your insight on. Where does tone come from? Well, it doesn't come from being ambidextrous. Uh, tone comes from your hands, what you think, and also with guitars. When you have a super thin neck, uh, your tone is usually thin. So the tone comes from the entire guitar. So it's not just a body and a headstock, it's everything. So I guess you need a good guitar, in, uh, we're talking electric. You sure. need a good amp, then you need to have hands that make it happen. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. okay. So, so, that's, what, so tone is, that's what makes guitar the most unique instrument in the world and the most popular. I can pick up this guitar and sound like me. You can pick it up and sound like you. Yeah. No other instruments like that. I mean, if I play a flute and you play a flute and you close your eyes, we're not going to get any tonal difference. The only thing that's different is the skill level. I might have more, you might have more than me. So it's tonally or a piano. It's skill level. The tone cannot change. Guitar has as, as many people that play guitar, that's how many uh, possibilities there are. For I like that answer. Man. How do I play guitar in three words or less? Practice, practice, practice. Michelangelo Badio, telling you to practice. Thanks. Thank you. Great interview.